We going to Puerto Rico. We going to Puerto Rico. Me pan, zu 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 zu. It is true, like right now until like, January 7th, until they decide something else, there's no, um, oh, he had a fun. <laughs> that guy was funny when I went inside, but yeah, no, um, they're, they're true to this, like, the police are out, they at the supermarket, they on the street, you don't got your mask, so it's, it's good, and people, you can come, like, our flight was packed to what it can be packed to. People are out here. A lot of people were returning back home to their families from, you know, the holiday. And then there were all, also people coming to have a good New Year. I like me. <laughs> um, but everything does close at 9. Like, there's no outdoor dining after 9. Um, and they do have places that are open until 11 for takeout. So we did want to hurry up and come out. And it is early, which I kind of love it because you know I'm an early bird. But one of the restaurants that we just went to, they badass was like, "Oh no, 7:30." We said late at 7:30. We walked in at 7:32. They didn't see us, like so. You know what time it is. Anyway, we're about to eat, and then we'll reconvene tomorrow because I need to enjoy myself. Skirt steak. I got some um, grilled shrimp, garlic shrimp. Thank you. Some garlic shrimp, rice and beans. Yeah, it doesn't matter because we don't open it. Um, and then my just this, this honey, I think. What did I get? Honey and, honey and cranberry. Yeah. All right. So good morning, everybody. And. We got in pretty abruptly, so we did go out last night, um, just to dinner. Again, you know when you get in, and depending on what time you get in somewhere, it might be late or whatever. So I am gonna show you a little bit of the house. I don't really want to take you inside of the Airbnb, but just know it's a nice studio. Um, and pretty much when we planned this trip, we were going to stay at a um, a hotel and. Um, in San Juan right um, along the beach where all the hotels are we're still in the same area we're literally across the street from it but all of that changed once COVID hit of course my trip was planned for April then we rebooked it for July because remember when everybody was like I think like nobody knew what was going on so we rebooked it for July and then of course People were going, but I just wasn't comfortable enough at that time. So we switched it to December into the new year to have a nice clean slate and a nice new year. So again, I'm gonna be showing you um, what we found on Airbnb, yeah, which I like. And what's sad is as we were coming, we did still see the devastated areas. It, it sort of reminded me of New Orleans. I feel like New Orleans still looked a little worse but it's, it's just all sad. Um, so that's the pool. That's just their storage, but the backyard is super cute, right? There is a sun deck. Love it up here so much. 
Okay, so I am on the sunroof, sunbathing, and I guess it's on a timer, but you guys can see there's the waterfall. It just makes the pool so much cuter. Because I was like, what is that noise? And then all of a sudden I smelled chlorine, so that's that. <laughs> drinking and still have my ponytail and the three twists I don't know I think this looks cute but it's still a little wet from this morning's swim so this is a dress I've worn before I wore it in Miami but I think it was very appropriate for Puerto Rico and it's only like 80 degrees so it shows enough skin but it's also covered so if it does get breezy outside i won't be cold because last night i was freezing and i had on short sleeve shirts so that is that see you guys there <laughs> restaurant we decided to eat at is this place called San Juan Smokehouse. Um, they have really good reviews for their barbecue. I love barbecue. So it was definitely a place to check out. Um, let's see what it's hitting for. I am about to start drinking. Oh, today's happy hour from 12 to 6. It's lit. But all right, um, we're about to eat and I'll let you know how it goes. Obviously, like this thing is booming like Ocean Drive, which I'm actually more comfortable with traveling like this. But you know, some people like when it's like super duper popular. Not me, I hate when it's crowded. But anyway, we're about to get our drink on, and then I guess we're gonna head back tonight because it is 3:56. Actually, we have a good amount of hours left, about five hours left before it's curfew. As you know, we gotta be in the house by nine. Drink it's the passion fruit one. I'm gonna taste it. So this is the Barilito. This is we're going to this rum distillery tomorrow, and of course the pina colada. And I'm gonna drink up. <laughs> I know. <laughs> After day drinking at La Placita, we ended up at Hadi's and it's around the corner from our Airbnb, which was great. Has great reviews, great food, and great drinks. Ooh, my meal looks delicious. Lance's food looks good. Look at it sizzling. This junk is burning. Delish. Yum. I gotta make this quick. We're on our way to this restaurant called Ola Ostern Bistro. And then we're doing our rum tour, our rum distillery tour. We're gonna end it off early, as you guys already know, at the, um, because of the nine o'clock curfew. But we did get some champagne. So we're just gonna live it up the new year in the crib. <laughs>
too. That's really cute up here. This is my first, I would say like more American meal. It's a chicken ciabatta, uh, chicken on ciabatta bread with some fries. So we're gonna enjoy our food. And we'll see you at the next video. to go places like this mm -hmm. like you know what i mean i'll just drive to the thing yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't. this is really the best pina cloud i've ever had in my life yeah that that shit that shit is different i should just say that. Yeah, that's not that much mm -hmm. yeah, when i return to be somewhere sunny grass fresh air all of that man i don't need no fucking city top looking all types of crazy hair look a mess fireworks going off yeah over there they're like everywhere. Hey everybody, 
last day in Puerto. It's January 1st and we are headed into the rainforest. I'll show you, it's so beautiful out here. And this it's gonna be a fun, today. that's my guide. Hola, Hector from Puerto Rico. <laughs> yes, Let's do it. nice. <laughs> We're gonna have a lot of fun and hopefully I don't die. I'm so mad my Apple Watch broke yesterday. I should probably take it off, right? Mm. Me too, I, I love shit like this. This is the easy part. We've been through a lot. <laughs> Woo. Okay. All right. some mishap a little bit but we made it through um and i pray that everybody's okay that was on in my group uh, you know the people that were um, that had that mishap but um everybody that they worked with worked together and then who i started with who i ended with it just it, whatever it all worked together um so we're now at this place um eating dinner and it was just off of a whim. Um, we had no place to go. A lot of the places close early in Puerto Rico, as you know. And it's New Year, so places close at eight today. So, what's the name of this place? Costa Azul. It's a really fancy restaurant. It's really cute. And it's right by our Airbnb, so we walked it. <laughs> um, anyway, this restaurant, really nice cocktails and well, really nice signature cocktails um, and again like I said um, it's a fancier restaurant so if you're looking for a nice sit down more romantic type of dinner this is definitely the place to come what's funny is that we weren't even looking for that type of place we just wanted to drink a little bit so um, this will be me ending it off um, I enjoyed my time in Puerto Rico it was very relaxing of course what I've done is it might not be what oh he's gonna play music isn't what you might want to do if you're looking for more of a super fun turn up ratchet I didn't let me take away ratchet that's judging that's judging but and it's not judgy because sometimes I want to be ratchet but it's not that type of um time to be booking a trip to Puerto Rico. If you're trying to lay low and just be, you know, relaxed, that's the type of trip that this is gonna be. And I did find that with a lot of my trips during COVID, it's been like that. So anyway, signing off. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I hope this helps you with any vacations you have um, or any trips you plan on um, are you plan to come on Puerto Rico was amazing the people are super nice and we had an awesome time so bye this is the ceviche with tostones this is my first time having ceviche on this whole trip like I don't even know how Check.